if the point a 0 comma 2 is equidistant from b 3 comma p and c p comma 5 so here distance between a b is equal to the distance between this point a is at equal distance from b and c c is p comma 5 so they give a b equals a c so if you write the formula distance formula under root x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so a c x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so now if you take the values this as like x1 y1 x2 y2 x1 y1 x2 y2 now i will substitute the values see under root x2 3 minus 0 whole square y2 that is p minus 2 whole square under root x2 is p minus 0 whole square and y2 is like 5 minus 2 whole square i will do here like squaring on both sides because roots will get cancelled so under root 3 minus 0 is 3 and p minus 2 so here whole square that equals p minus 0 is p 5 minus 2 is 3 square again whole square square and root square and root cancel so 3 square is 9 clearly p minus 2 a minus b whole square a square minus 2ab plus b square so here p 2ab and here 2 and right side p square plus 9 now see so you can cancel here like 9 and 9 p square p square so you are left with like minus 4p plus 4 equals 0 so if you will calculate minus 4p equals minus 4 p equals minus 4 by minus 4 p equals 1 so the value of p is 1 also find the length of a b length of a b so here a is 0 2 and b is 3 comma b so 3 comma 1 so we need to find the distance so a b distance under root x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so here if you substitute the values x1 y1 x2 y2 so 3 minus 0 whole square plus 1 y2 is 1 minus 2 whole square so 3 minus 0 whole square is 3 square 1 minus 2 is minus 1 so here 3 square is 9 minus 1 whole square is 1 so the answer is here root 10 so length is root 10 units root 10 units